Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having an amazing day. So today I have a little um, Enel Couture haul. Um, over the Mother's Day weekend, he was having a promotion where if you use code MOM22, you got 22% uh, off. So I thought, oh wow, I gotta wanted to get some stuff that I've been wanting, kind of treat myself for Mother's Day. So we'll go ahead and get right into it. All right. So let's see, I'll open this action. Oh yeah, so this is an acrylic um, kit. He has like little not a really a starter kit but just like little mini kits um i've been seeing a lot of people saying that the eternal beige well i've been seeing you know on people's posts they use the eternal beige and it's just a beautiful beige and it comes in this kit so i was going to order it separately and i think it was 9.99 for and i believe it was this size i think this is the 0.5 um, grams but I thought okay that's $9.99 but for $14.99 you get three and then you get a little monomer so I thought that was a better a better deal so and I thought they had the colors on the website it had the color here and I don't see that on here oh wow that's kind of weird. So yeah, I know you get a white, a pink, and then the beige. So that's really strange that it doesn't have the... Oops, this one kind of spilled. So yeah, this is the white. I'll go ahead and swatch these two at the end. This looks like the beige. Really, really pretty. And then the last one must be the pink. Oh no, this looks like a white too. Hmm. I don't know, I'm kind of confused now. So I thought you got a pink, a white, and the eternal beige. Hmm. Okay, I'll have to swatch them and see. I mean, let me see. Yeah, I mean, they both, well, this one does, this one does look like it's a very, very pale pink. Maybe it is. I don't know if you can tell the difference through here but like I said I'll swatch those and then you get this little two ounce um, this is the pink magic fast dry I haven't tried the fast setting monomer and then I did order I've seen a lot of people use these buffers the smoothie buffers um, this is an 80 80 grit so I wanted to try that so I did get two because I'm gonna put one in a giveaway in my videos, I'm going to start giving little hints of things that will be in the giveaway when I hit 500 subscribers. I think about two videos back, I um, I also was giving some hints about the giveaway. So yeah, I'll show some, you know, my hauls or like I'll just talk about it during the video. So make sure you watch the whole video so that way you don't miss out. But yeah, I'll be putting one of these in the giveaway. Alright, so I got the, um, it's called Dom Top Coat, and I've seen a lot of people use this. I see him use it in his uh, lives. It's a top coat, but it says in the description, it's a thick, no-wipe, tempered top coat, scratch-resistant, high-gloss, soak-off gel, um, soak-off gel, long-lasting, you know so yeah it's just a thicker kind of top coat but i guess it's real scratch resistant so um yeah let's see so yeah that is pretty pretty thick and then this is a new um gel polish i guess it is that he came out with it's called hologram power I'm gonna swatch it, but oh, it looks so pretty. Look at that. Oh, it's gorgeous. Like a silver metallic, but it's got like rainbow. Let me see if I can with the flash here. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, that's gorgeous. 
Yeah, he showed this too outside. He went outside and showed it on some swatches and oh, it's just gorgeous. I do love these, these brush wipes. Uh, I've showed them in I think every haul I think I get them. But they're the pink wipes and they're really, really good. I love them. I usually cut them in half because they are kind of large. But yeah, I really, really like these brush wipes. And then I did get two so I can put one in the giveaway. And then I did get a bunch of, not too many, but stickers. And then I wanted to try these stones. He uses these a lot in his videos. And I've seen Femi also use um, these stones. There's a lot of different colors, but I just started off with these two. This is the unicorn unicorn opal let me turn the flash off sorry so yeah it's it's got a white background but then it's um basically like holo you know hologram holographic so yeah they're white on the back and then they have this real pretty purple pink i mean different different color shifts to them and then I thought for the summer, these, this is called Magic Mango. So it's like a, basically like an orange with rainbow. So yeah, I thought these would be fun for the summer. And then we'll go on to the stickers. So I got a lot of summer stickers just because I can't wait to do some summer designs. But this one, I think this one's called Triton's Daughters. Look at that, aren't they cute? Super cute, oh, I love it. Got that, and this one is 222, because I know on the website it's easy to look for, um, when you scroll down to look for the number, it's easier to find the stickers. This one is 178. Yeah, we get the pineapples, the different kind of flamingo, toucan, tropical birds, the flowers. It says sunshine, just a bunch. I just thought they were so pretty. And then this next one is 121. This one has, this is another one. This one has pineapples and it says Aloha beaches, beach girl, beach beach vibes only sandy salty happy just a bunch of little sayings and i just thought those were super fun and then this one is 165. this one i think was called hummingbird real pretty too look at that how cute those little hummingbirds are and the, the little flowers and leaves there just ooh, really summery i love it and these are super pretty too and then the last one I got here is some clouds and stars. That's number 164. And yeah, they're just like pastel, really light um, clouds and little stars. Just different colors. I just thought those were pretty. But yeah, I love, love his products. Um, my nails right now, I just did a quick... These are actually acrylic. His acrylic. It's the um, Makeup Pink. And it's like a peachy light color with sparkles so yeah I was like oh I just love this I'm gonna have to get another one because I think it's about halfway done but yeah I used that in my uh, last set and then I just did this one I didn't film this one but I got these stickers you'll see this in my my last um, video the Shein haul and it kind of looks like a it's not focusing a French you know tip with the tulips so yeah I just thought those were fun but yeah I like his acrylic so excited okay, look at these after so I just got a tip box um, this is going in the giveaway because I do have I think I mentioned it and forgot which video it was but I mentioned about the giveaway and I do have the long sculptor square tips for the giveaway those are my absolute favorite tips um, so yeah, I'm going to put those in the giveaway and then I'm going to give you a tip box too to, to put them in. All right. So this is what I'm really excited about. These are the neon liner gels and this is the, of course, the neon collection. 
All right, so I got my swatch stick here, and I just want to go ahead and do this um, hologram power one. I'm excited for this one. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, that's pretty. Super pretty. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I'll turn the flash on right now, but even without the flash, it's really pretty in the... Oh, it's a good consistency. Look at that. It's one coat. Not see-through at all. Oh, wow. Look at that. Very nice. This is going to be fun. All right, let's see what the... Look at that. Oh my goodness. So I want to go ahead and try out the Dom top coat and see how that is. So I'm just going to do it on top of the hollow power. So yeah, it's thick, but I mean, it's not hard to work with. I mean, you know, it's gliding really nice. Because some of them, when they're super thick, it's like they kind of drag, you know, kind of get stuck a little bit, I guess. But this one's, yeah, it's really nice. So I'm excited for these. So we're going to go ahead and see, take a look at the neon liners. This is 011. Oh, the brush is really nice. Really pretty. Oh, I love it. That's one coat, and that's pretty good. And then the 012, that's the orange. Ooh, that's pretty. Really pretty. The 013, which is the green. Yeah, these are my first um, liner gels from Eno Couture. I don't have any. Ooh, that's pretty. And we have the 014, which is the pink. Oh, I like that. Very pretty. And the last one is the 015, which is the yellow. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. Oh, that's like a, a highlighter. Your highlighter yellow. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's pretty. All right, so these are the liners here. Just, oh, they're just beautiful. So I'm gonna go ahead and we'll swatch these and I'm also gonna be trying out the Pink Magic Fast Dry because I've never used, like I said, I have the Cotton Candy uh, monomer. And this is the brush, the Joss Love that I did a, vid a video on um, a review and I actually really do like this brush. I actually use it on this set that I have have on now. So let's see here. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it on the inside. But yeah, that's definitely the, the white. I like it. It's really white. Wow, oh, it's like a bright, <laughs> very bright white. Wow. Okay, yeah, that bead set up pretty, f setting up pretty fast. I forgot this was the fast setting. I was like, whoa, wait a minute. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me, but it does look like the monomer might have turned it purple. A little, I mean, I don't know, to me. I think this next one is the pink. The princess pink. Okay, this is weird. It's, um, yeah, it looks like it's turning it purple. Let me get my other monomer and see if it does the same thing. Okay, this one is the cotton candy, um, monomer. I just want to see, um, it turns it. I've never had that problem. So I don't know. That's pretty weird. So yeah, let's see if it does that. I don't know. It's hard to tell. I don't think. Yeah, this one looks more purple. This one. 
This one's like a very light, like a glass um, pink. Yeah, you can see that that's got a purple tint to it. That's so weird. Like I said, I've never used fast setting uh, monomer, but this is just the, the regular, regular one. So yeah, that's just like a glassy pink, but yeah, you can see that one has a purple, yeah, purple tint to it. Alright, so now I'm going to do the eternal beige. I'm going to do both again and see if it changes the color. Okay, so this is the eternal beige. That is pretty. So we're going to try it with the fast setting monomer. I don't know because it kind of looks like it's giving it a pinkish tint. It looks, I don't know, I can't really tell. <sighs> okay, now we'll try the regular set and we'll do it up here. Yeah, see that's got yeah, it's definitely got a, it gives it like a purpley tint. Yeah. How weird. I don't even know. If you guys know if you use fast setting uh, monomers, if you can let me know. All right, let's see. This is why I wanted to do the acrylic glass because, you know, I'm pretty messy. But, so let's see with the regular. So yeah, that's white. So yeah, see, yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, this is different. I don't know if it's hard for you guys to tell, but this one has a purple tint to it. All right, guys, so that's everything that I got in this e -Nail Couture haul. I just wanna say thank you to everyone that's always showing support and all the subscribers. You guys are just amazing and so encouraging. I really love this nail community. Everybody's so helpful and supports each other and Oh, I just love it. I really appreciate it. So thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. And we will see you next time. Bye.